someone recently asked me why is the winch, the cable winch, which is designed to be a hoist, why is it oriented like a winch where the wire goes out sideways rather than just lifting up and down? That's a really good question and it's because of the application. So if we come back here and we take a look at the elevator itself, you'll see that it has got risers on the four corners. Okay, it's got running gear on the four corners. That's four wires, but there's only one cable coming off of the uh, winch hoist thing. So what I had to do was to create to aggregate those four, eh, those four cables into one. And you can see what I did way up there. Okay, so now that's part of the problem. That's solved, okay? But there's more. I have to be able to have enough single wire run to allow the four wire run to reach back to the pillow blocks that go to the running gear. All right, just think about that. So there's gotta be enough wire available. So what I did is I traversed the ceiling here in the barn and there's a block up against that back area there that gives me enough run room. Oh, I'm trying to reach the remote right now. So when I'm lifting, <laughs> Can travel and it doesn't run out of room in fact it's got six inches to spare and the same can be said for here it's very very close so when you do these you measure once twice three times and when you start putting crimson things on you need to consider that something else to consider is if you look at those I don't think they're really called pillow blocks, but you'll see how they're, they're mounted sideways. They're not in the same plane. One's above the other so that the cable for one can run and not interfere with the other, but they all come together. You have that right angle turn there and you end up with four parallel cables. And then you have the motor here. So, I hope that answers your question. You have to be able to make one wire turn into four wires for the falls that are lifting and lowering the elevator. And that's why it's horizontal. Um, there are old school things that have been done in the past where they'll have like a drum with the four wires on it and you're rotating the drum. I don't have room for that. I don't have money for that. I can't have that. So. Harbor Freight to the rescue. I will look up and tell you where I got this running gear. That's galvanized cable and not line fiber. So you need unique special running gear for it or it will chew up everything. I say that as a degree of caution for your safety's sake. All right, there's the answer. Bye-bye.